So let's go a little bit deeper into the meaning of the word musallin. When Allah SWT mentions the word musallin here, he's actually referring to belief and iman. Because salah is the biggest sign of iman. Now the word for believers is generally mu'mineen, which is clearly different from the word musallin. So how do we know that they can be used interchangeably? So as it comes in Surah Baqarah, وَمَا كَانَ اللَّهُ لِيُضِيعَ إِيمَانَكُمْ إِنَّ اللَّهَ بِالنَّاسِ لَرَؤُوفٌ رَحِيمٌ And never would Allah have caused you to lose faith, meaning prayers. Indeed, Allah is to the people kind and merciful. So here the word uses iman, and as we'll learn in a little bit, it actually means prayer. Because this ayah in Surah Baqarah was revealed after Nabi Sallallahu migrated to Medina. So when he was in Mecca, he used to pray towards Bayt al but because Bayt al and Bayt were in the same line, he also was facing towards Bayt When he moved to Medina, it was no longer possible to face both Bayt al and Bayt at the same time because they were in opposite directions. Geographically, Medina is in the middle of Mecca and Sham. So when you're in Medina, on one side is Bayt al and on the other side is Bayt so for a few months, Nabi Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam continued to pray towards Bayt al but he had a strong desire to face towards the Qibla of Ibrahim alayhi salam, which is Bayt al So these ayats were revealed about the change of direction of prayer from Bayt al to Bayt al However, when Muslims started to pray towards Bayt al they developed a concern about those believers who had passed away in Makkah while they were facing Bayt al So the concern was, that their prayers were lost since they were facing the wrong Qibla, i.e. they were not facing Baitullah at that time, rather Baitul Mahdus. So Allah SWT revealed this ayah in which he used the word imanakum for salah to reassure believers that the prayers of their deceased companions were not wasted, they were not lost. So again, coming back to the original point, could the word musallin be referring to mumin? Yes, I just learned that indeed salah is equated to iman. 